Hey guys, how are you doing today? Happy quarantine day. You know what? I don't think I still know what the day it is, but uh, today I'm going to give you guys a, a leg workout that is based on uh, mainly just isometrics. So if you got bad knees, your knees hurts when you do, you know, squats and leg, certain leg exercises, this will help you gain strength around that uh, with, with the least amount of movement. Uh, this workout is harder than it looks, okay? You should feel it mainly in the quads. If you feel it in the knees, uh, just you know, practice your position and make sure you're in the right position. But this is an isometric leg workout, so you can follow along with me, and then I'll show you what else to do. Okay. First one we're gonna do, we're gonna do wiggles. Okay. We're gonna start with our feet together. We're gonna slightly bend down, and we can have our hands right about right here on our thighs. Okay. The first movement's gonna be forward, so we're gonna go like this. We're just gonna go one, two. Next movement is to the right twice. One, two. Next movement is to the left twice. One, two. Then we're going to circle going to the right twice. One, two. To the left twice. One, two. Then we're going to figure eight once to the right. And then once to the left. Okay? Then we go a little bit lower and we repeat. Two forward. One, two. To the right twice. One, two. To the left twice. One, two. Two, circle right twice, one, two, circle left twice, one, two, figure eight to the right once, figure eight to the left once. Third time, a little bit lower, put your hands on your knees now, okay, and forward, one, two, right twice, left twice, circle right twice, circle left twice, figure eight to the right once, figure eight to the left once, and relax. You should feel a burn right in through here. Now, for those of you with not the best balance in the world, maybe do it on a chair, holding on, okay, with the different positionings, okay? Same thing applies. Just don't get too much of the hips and all that going. Just moving the knees forward, right twice, and all that. So hold on to a chair, okay? Next up, we're going to do sumos. All right, so we're going to get the sumo stance out like this. We're going to put our hands on the outside, we're going to squeeze for five seconds. Push in with your hands, out with the legs, knees, and go. One, two, three, four, and five. Relax. Now we go inside, reverse it, and pull out, and push in, and go. One, two, three, four, and five. Relax. Stand up. Whew. We're going to repeat that again. Sumo. And press. One, two, three, four, five. Inside. One, two, three, four, five and five, and relax. All right, one more time, and press. One, two, three, four, and five. Inside, and one, two, three, four, and five. Good, and relax. Okay, next up is accordions, okay? We're going to go shoulder width apart, a little bit narrower. We're gonna squat down, okay? I don't want, you can, if you can go all the way down, that's fine too, but let's just start up here. Hands right here, and then we're going to accordion our feet out. Back and forth, and then back in. Let me get that positioning this way. There's one time. Let's do it again. Accordion out, and then accordion in. Come on up. Now let's do it one more time for a third time, but I'm going to show you doing it with the chair. So we can easily hold the chair, and then squat down. And accordion in and out. Back and forth three total times and then rest. Last one, I want you to get either a towel or a couple towels or paper towels and we're going to turn it sideways and we're going to put it between our legs like so. Squat down as low as you can and you're going to act like you're skiing. But you're going to squeeze this together. You're just going to hold isometric for a 10 count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Relax. Let's do that one more time. I'll add in the chair so you can hold on to a chair. Okay, we're going to squat down, skiing position like this, and squeeze. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. And relax. So there's your isometric leg workout, okay? Challenge you, 
Go through that once. Maybe rest for two to three minutes. Do that again a second time. And maybe work up to a third time if you like. But let's go through the first movement again really quick. Because sometimes that confuses people. So it's three different positions. We start here, one, for the first time. Then we go two. Then we go a little bit lower, three. Okay? So the movement is two forward, two to the right, two to the left, circle right twice, circle left twice, figure eight once going to the right, figure eight once going to the left. That's the little routine, and then you go a little bit lower and do it, and then a little bit lower. All right, that's a isometric workout for the legs, but you will get a burn. Uh, next time, we're going to do some uh, uh, either more arm stuff for your uh, shoulders and rotator cuff, and then also some more leg stuff for more just basic overall leg movement. All right, thank you very much. Have a good day.